Uh oh! John, I'm not doing this. Impact detected. Oh my god, it's going haywire. So today, me and Ting Tong have come to Robin Hood Stride. Never been here before. Perfect place to test out DJI Avata in manual mode. We've only got one battery though. That's the worst thing. John, what are your thoughts? Oh, that Pepsi's just done one straight over edge. <laughs> So it's very windy today, but we're still going to test the DJI Avata in full manual mode. Now it's time to fly the Avata in manual for the first time in terrible wind in a stupid place. But we're going to try it. 94%. I'm not in manual, I am in normal. So I'm going to take off it. So that's in normal mode, and the wind is wild. So I'm going to have to fly away a bit and somehow get it into manual without crashing. Wait, I'm in manual. This feels weird. Let's see what, it's, see what this puppy can do. So it actually feels quite, I won't say stable, but just not a fan of this controller. I think it just ruins everything. Well, she rips. She, whoa, she has not got the power of the Cinelog to recover. It's not, uh, and uh, these are all with stock rates. This is all stock rates. But this has not got the recovery punch. Maybe it's the wind. I'm, I'm using a lot of throttle here just to keep it up. Wind's taking it now. That's not me. That's wind. Right, I'm going to get another little flipperoo. Oh, it flips all right. It flips all right. Don't matter, don't matter. Yeah, it's, do you know what? Get it behind you and I can go uh, John, 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 it's manual, it's wind. And this, whoa, 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 that weren't me, that were wind. Remote controller stick error, one minute. Right, I've got into sport mode now. Look at the angle, the wind is horrendous. High wind velocity. So I need to land this now, um, which is not going to be easy. So I'm going to take goggles off. I'm going to bring it in line of sight. Wow, it's trying to keep momentum, even in sport. This is horrible to fly in wind. Right, normal mode. It's a twitchy little thing. Wow, that was something. So it's not got much punch compared to um, a normal cine whoop. But it's not made for that. It's not made for dives and... But, flies pretty good. It does fly nice. But that O3 footage, that is quality. So we're gonna, now, nah, we're gonna go back down the hill where there's no wind, try and fly it through trees, because it's still got 80% battery. Well, about 80 summit. So we're gonna try that. But it's just a pain that you have to rebind this when you've used an O3. You have to fully rebind the controller, which sucks, but that's life. Let's go. We've got 75% battery. And it's saying remote controller stick error. Fantastic. Jesus Christ. It's just useless, this. This controller is absolutely... DJI, get rid of this. It's useless. Let's try it again. So I've got the Avata recording now. We're just going to switch straight to manual. Right, we're in manual. So let's see what we can do. Here we've got Ting Tong. It definitely feels heavy for a cine whoop. See, that was a battery level low there at 72%. Battery level low, throttle output reduced. I've got 72% battery here. Battery level low, remote controller stick error. I'm not, I'm not a fan of the Avata at all. You can't be a just normal cine whoop. So once this wind dies down, I'm gonna try and get it back in manual mode. I hate the sticks on this controller, they're stiff, they're too short, and they're just spiky and horrible. 
So now I'm going to try to get back in manual, see if we can actually do something with this Avata. Right, we're in manual, let's see if we can get through these tree gaps. Oh, it's down! It's down! John! Avata's a piece of poo. So I've retrieved the Avata. We're going to get another little door. I'm trying to, I'm trying to see the good side to this drone, I really am. At the minute I just don't see one. I think all the hype is probably from people who've never flown anything but an FPV like DJI FPV. I think that's where this hype comes from. Let's see if it even takes off. You just can't beat a normal Cinewhoop. I really wanted to love this. Still got a 64% battery as well. Right, straight into manual. Oh no, I think... So I'm in sport mode. I'm just going to go out with it. Right, switch into manual. Right, we're in manual. We've got 63% and we're getting re remote controller stick error. Maybe it just needs some tweaking, I don't know. I mean, once it's flying, it does fly nice. I just don't like the fact that, that it doesn't feel punchy. Unless you full throttle it. Oh, that yaw was horrible. Really want to love the Avata, but at the minute, it's just not happening. Maybe it's the controller though, because I really hate this controller. Let's go for another, another mission fruit trees. Flying a bit better now anyway. Um, so I got this remote control stick error. Maybe it's down to that, who knows. Tell you what though, the image transmission is unbelievable. Come back down to these woods now. Wind's picking up now. Um, it's making it pretty tricky. I know, John, John, stop. I'm going to turn the angle up a bit. 23 degrees, we've got 52% battery. This probably will now fly a lot better. A lot more to how I have my normal rates on my other drones. Let's navigate these woodland areas. Oh, now she's now she's showing her true colours. I've got it in a good mode. It's ripping a bit more, but wind's not being its friend at all. That wind is absolutely severe. Uh oh. John, I'm not doing this. Impact detected. Oh my God, it's going haywire. John, John, John. 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 What? It's going freaking haywire. It's quite mild. No, though. John, John, I can't control anything it's doing. John. Can you see where it is? It's in field, I can't see it now at all. Right, I'm trying to fly it in a direction. At minute it's letting me do it. I'm in sport mode. That is ridiculous what it just did. It lost total control and came up with a lot of warnings. Do you see it, John? Yeah. This miles. drone is absolute it's trash. Not only, in, only in sport. And it, guess what? The stick error's gone. So at least when it crashed, it got rid of that stick error. So the remote control stick error's gone, but that... I thought that was coming straight down onto a rock, upside down. And that's the Avata, ladies and gentlemen. That is the Avata for you. An absolute piece of trash. So... That was ridiculous. I wish I had a memory card in goggles so you could have seen the feed that I saw. It, it was having those stick errors and then it just literally flipped upside down and started flying straight down for no reason at all. It just 
something took over and it just flipped itself and I was moving the sticks, not, it would not right itself, I had plenty of time, just came straight down, smashing on its head. I think that's what it did anyway. Um, then it flew off and it was just flying itself. I was flicking through modes, I was trying sport, normal, manual, I didn't go back to manual because I was still in manual when it, when it started doing that. But that is ridiculous, dangerous, I wouldn't fly this. Most places, I don't trust this thing. If you want a cinewop, buy a proper cinewop. This has just shown what what it's worth. It just needs a good. Um, it needs clean it up with uh, some baby wipes and then eBay. It's going on eBay. I'm very disappointed. Wanted to love it, didn't I? What do you think, Ting Tong? Rubbish. But when it was flying good, I enjoyed it. When I when I put it up to like 20 odd degrees, I was loving it. And then it had to just go and ruin it for everyone, didn't it? And some some bug in the system took over there. I I can't wait to watch it back. Um, I don't know if it stopped recording. We'll have, we'll have to see, won't we? At least nothing's broken on it, and I can sell it. Um, I'm very disappointed with Ivata. I wanted to love this. I was even thinking maybe buy more batteries and use it. But what point? Can't beat a proper cine whoop. That's pants. Goggles are good though. Goggles are worldly. Out of this world, these goggles. But yeah, don't buy Novata. Don't buy DJI FPV. Buy a Cinelog. Buy a Nazgul. Buy something that works. Transmission is insane. I'm fully behind structure now, we've got perfect signal. Wind's just not very nice. I don't like these sticks. I'm going to try and get through that gap, Johnny Rocks. Try and get that. No, I've gone through. Right, I've made it. We did it. It's a fantastic. This, this O3 system is unbelievable. Wow. I've never seen signal like this in my life. It's like watching 4K. That wind is horrendous. But this signal is unbelievable. Very windy. is unbelievable in these goggles. If you've got a Vista, throw it in bin. I'm gonna go home and drop kick my Vista's dark toilet because you need these O3 units. Absolute game changer. And now, Connor told me a little trick. When you've set your GoPro up, always hold off. Then it'll save your settings that you've changed. O3 unit. Ugh, so good, go and buy one. DJI, that is kick ass. That is insane how good that is. I can't even put into words. I just wish there were no wind and I could just go through these tree gaps and that is staggering. That is absolutely staggering. Do you want to watch that? That is properly good. Subscribe to your YouTube, Steel City Drone Pilot.
da -da -da. Introducing Ting Tong John, the region's biggest wazak. <laughs> <laughs> what a wazak. <laughs>